Lauren Popolek. I'm a veterinary surgeon and the veterinary technical advisor for Interchem. Before you adopt your Greyhound, you should take some steps to prepare your home before his arrival. You should always choose to adopt at a time when you have enough available time outside of work to help with the adjustment period, which is usually around a month when any dog is coming into a new home. One of the first things you should do is move through your home and garden to make sure that it's safe for the greyhounds. So when you're going through your yard, uh, check for any bones, sticks, or rubbish that could potentially be chewed or be dangerous. You also wanna rock the perimeter of your garden and make sure that it's safe and well enclosed. Uh, fencing should be about one and a half to two meters because greyhounds are very athletic and can jump very high. You also want to check for any gaps to make sure that they can be properly contained and that there aren't any dangers of them escaping. So I would definitely walk through the house and make sure that it's safe and free of electrical cables or any wires. Greyhounds are also not used to many different surfaces, so when they are on the tracks, they're typically on outdoor surfaces or concrete, and they may not be familiar with your home and different surfaces like tile and laminate and wood, and they can be very slippery and even scary for a lot of greyhounds. During that adjustment period, it may be helpful to put down some different floor runners and rugs or skids um, in the common areas, as well as especially on the stairs to make sure that they don't have any trouble with slipping. Greyhounds have also likely never seen mirrors or glass. Um, it could be fearful, but they also may just walk into them as it's something that they're unfamiliar with. So putting decals onto glass and mirrors will be helpful to help them identify them and prevent any injuries. We recommend that you find a quiet personal space for your Greyhound in a common area where people are usually around and socializing. Greyhounds are very intelligent animals and it's important to provide them with plenty of enrichment. We do recommend the Kong toys. Um, all Kong toys are safe and cannot be chewed into bits that will cause any problems in their digestive tract. They all come with holes where you can stuff pieces of kibble or different treats, even things like cheese and peanut butter that can be smeared. And then they can spend a lot of time trying to get the treat out um, and licking it and having lots of positive reinforcement. Uh, toys like this are designed so that they can play with them in order to knock the kibble out of the hole and receive their treat. So it's a nice positive experience and providing this in their safe personal space will help enforce uh, that positive experience in their bed. So you want to leave the area nice and open so the Greyhound has plenty of time to adjust to the area and establish that as their personal space in their own time. Before you bring your Greyhound home, it would be important to be familiar with body language and signs of fear. Typical body posture would be cowering or lowering their body with their ears back. Often we can sometimes see lots of pacing and vigilance as well. And this is just a sign that they may have some fear and may need some help adjusting to their new home. Interchem does distribute Adaptil products. Adaptil products release dog appeasing pheromone, which has been shown to induce a comforting sensation in dogs and help them with anxiety. Adaptil can be plugged in 24 hours before your new greyhound comes into your home. Evidence has shown Adaptil can help reduce anxiety and promote reinsurance when your dog is introduced to its new home.